Sometimes we have no money to buy food, and my grandson Brett will cry and cry throughout the night. The needs of the people are immense here. The livelihood which they earn is somewhere between one to two dollars. And that itself, if they get, is a great miracle for them. When we hear their stories, you are hearing the common phrase. They go and strive to see if they can get at least one meal a day. My daughter Jadzia had to drop out of high school when we discovered she was pregnant with Brett. When Brett turned one, I agreed to take care of him so my daughter could return to school and find work. So these children are really from the underprivileged community. So the first thing uh, that we started here was we, we are sponsoring around 70 children in the Gasabo district, ECD. Now ECD is Early Childhood Development which is an initiative by the government for primary education of the underprivileged children. So in the ECD program, they do uh, different things to help children grow uh, from uh, teaching them or stimulating their brain, uh, providing food uh, to help uh, improve their nutrition. We have also story time. Children love that moment. They love to hear the story from their teacher. You can see that there is, a, there is a big difference. So it makes me feel really good and also I feel like a, it's my calling. What else can I be happy for than seeing young ones being uh, transformed to become a, a better future? I can honestly say it is only by God's grace that I was able to enroll Brett. I was so excited when Brett was accepted into ECD I started singing and praising God for all he has done. And we are hoping the more uh, the other years he's in ECD, that he will be able to also to learn other skills like writing, the basics, singing, and do other things. So you can see there is a growth uh, when you compare how he was and how he is today. Whenever Brett brings home a report card, his teacher writes, great job, excellent work. And when there is a class assignment, he is always in the top three. One day, he came home and asked to pray for me because his teachers had taught him the importance of prayer. ECD has been not only a huge blessing for Brett, but for me as well. I don't have to worry about how I will save for his education and can spend that money on things like food and clothing. It is important for us to reach out to these vulnerable children. If we don't uh, reach out to the children, we are in, indeed going to miss out on another generation. I want to thank you for helping us. Because of you, Brett is able to study and succeed in life. There is a lot, a lot of things people can do in the world, but deciding to help the young ones who are vulnerable, who are poor, it's a uh, I don't know how I can thank them, but God bless them and God bless them abundantly.